Hey, Albert. Um, just kind of how, how did it feel to hit that home run? Because obviously we know that that's your, your former team over there. Well, I said it early today, but I, uh, it's not the first home run here against the Angels. So to me, it was just, uh, you know, I'm just glad that I was able to contribute today to the ball club and help our, our ball club to win the series today. So uh, I really, you know, didn't put too much thought about it. Obviously, you know, it can look different way where it can look sweet because it's against your former team. But, uh, you know, I, I don't look at it like that. I look at it every time I, I'm out there, no matter who I'm facing, try to help our ball club to win. But overall, just kind of how was your weekend? Obviously, you, you mentioned that you have played against that organization before. Um, but seeing some of your former teammates and your coaches um, the whole weekend, what was that like for you? Uh, it's great. You know, it's, uh, you know, that's the first time I see some of those guys until I got released. So, uh, you know, I, I still have a great relationship, you know, with uh, 95 percent of those guys over there. So, um, you know, it's great to say hello and just doing batting practice and just to say hi, you know, to some of the guys that I'm close with uh, on the other side. So but uh, at the end of the day, we all have a job to do and that's to get ready to play the game. So, uh, you know, as soon as I was done saying my hello, I really stay focused and what I had to do Friday to get prepared for the game. And, you know, today, not much preparation, just pretty much, you know, unfortunately I had to come in because just JT, you know, uh, you know, had a little injury, but uh, hopefully, you know, he's, he's okay. Uh, you know, we, we don't want uh, anybody in our team, you know, or you to come in because somebody got hurt, you know, so I didn't have much preparation about it, but, you know, when my name was called, uh, I made sure that I was ready to go. So and I'm glad, you know, that I was able to contribute. Albert, you guys have 50 games left in the regular season. Just overall, what do you get? What do you think you guys are as a team right now? Well, that's the thing. I think we are right where we want to be. Uh, we know that we haven't been playing the best baseball that, that we know uh, how to play. And obviously, then that I know seeing this organization play over the last 20 years. So I know we have a great group of guys, great team. I think, you know, we just got some of the guys healthy back. So... I think, you know, the next 50 games, you know, is going to be really, uh, you know, a goal for us because, uh, you know, we don't want to change anything. I think for us, uh, you know, we're going to take the same approach. We're always ready to go every day, who, whoever, no matter who we're facing. And I think uh, that's something that, that I love about this ball club. You know, and we got a couple of tough series that we lost and, you know, we bounce back right away and, and top of all, tough losses, you know, and we bounce back right away. That's the attitude that you want. And obviously there's a, a lot of game left and we just need to contribute to win series and, you know, see where we at, I, I think, at the end of the season. Next question is from Fabian Ardaya. Go ahead. Hey, Albert. Uh, when you first came over here, obviously they're pretty clear about what your role would be. I mean, how do you feel like you fit into that role now that you're a couple months into it? No, I mean, uh, obviously I think that's the main thing that, you know, uh, Doug and Andrew were really straightforward with me. Hey, this is the role we have for you. Are you up for? And obviously, you know, uh, I agree on it. So uh, I think, you know, I'm always ready to go no matter what. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm excited. I know the opportunity, great organization. And, you know, I love these guys. Uh, I, I said it early and I keep saying it all year long. I feel like I, I'm part of this team since your day one, you know, and that's, I think, because the veteran leadership and the young players, you know, the way that they go out and respect and, and, and really make it fun for you. So uh, these guys are like my family, my brothers. So I think that's something, you know, that I always going to share with me, uh, no matter what ball club I'm playing with. <clears throat> and I know when you signed, you said you still, you felt like you had some gas left in the tank. I mean, having the results that you have had as a Dodger, I mean, how much does that sort of reaffirm how you were feeling? Well, you know me, man, you know, for a while, I, I think, you know, you go by how you feel. I feel healthy. I feel that I can contribute to this ball club. And if uh, that wouldn't be the case, I don't think I would have standing in this chair. Or I wouldn't be in this clubhouse, you know. And I think when you have somebody, you know, from the front office to believe on you, like the Andrew and the whole front office staff, and you have a manager, you know, like Doc, and the whole coaching staff believe in you that you can – help this ball club out, that's why they brought me here and they believe in me and, and I believe that I can help this ball club to win and I'm just glad, you know, the guy opened another door for me. So, uh, you know, I'm really excited. Thanks, Albert. Siguiente pregunta de Claudia Gesto. Adelante. 
Albert, buenas tardes. Sabemos que la oficina de Los Ángeles Dodgers trae un buen talento a este equipo, añadiendo esas nuevas piezas a este equipo. ¿Qué tipo de energía ha traído a este clubhouse? Claro, son una pieza que se necesitaban, tú sabes, en este equipo. Tú sabes, Max y, y Trent son dos, tú sabes, peloteros bien especial. Tú sabes que nos pueden ayudar a lograr lo que nosotros queremos y ganar otro campeonato. Así que eh, todo el mundo sabe lo que ellos pueden hacer cuando están saludables y nosotros estamos súper contentos de tenerlo en nuestro equipo. Y ahí te puede enseñar cómo la oficina es bien agresiva, que no piensan dos veces y, y para ello es ganar ahora, no es el año que viene ni el año, ni el año después de ese. Este año, tú sabes, esta organización quiere ganar y, y se enfoca todo el tiempo. Último para mí es, ¿cuánto esta carrera en la división está haciendo que este equipo mejore cada día? Bueno, yo creo que nosotros lo que nos estamos enfocando en lo que nosotros podemos hacer, lo que los otros equipos hacen está fuera de nuestras manos. Así que, tú sabes, nosotros controlamos en nuestro destino y en verdad que cada día que venimos aquí nos preparamos y tratar de, de ganar cada juego si se puede. Gracias.